Hi everyone, I'm extremely excited to show you around this apartment. It's in 2 Avenue Road, which is arguably one of St John's Wood's most prestigious blocks. It was newly refurbished back in 2011 to an exceptionally high standard. It has two bedrooms, two bathrooms, underground parking for two cars, 24 hour concierge, passenger lift, and the most incredible views, which I will show you in just a moment. Come and take a look. So as we exit the lift on the seventh floor, there's just two apartments on this level. And uh, as we enter the apartment, you're first of all greeted with a very, very welcoming entrance hall. Again, everything was refurbished here, as I mentioned, back in 2011. And uh, everything was done to an exceptionally high standard. Uh, you're greeted with a uh, coats cupboard, coats and shoes as you enter. Uh, beautiful tiled floor. It's underfloor heating in the tiled areas. So as you enter this most glorious reception room, you can see this great attention to detail and everything has been done to an exceptionally high standard. But if we have a look over here, this is the masterpiece of the apartment. It has the most phenomenal panoramic views over London, showing all the iconic buildings, the London Eye, BT Tower, the NatWest Tower, there's Battersea over there in the background as well. And before all of that, you've got Regent's Park, which you can see right in front of you. It really is tremendous. You have air conditioning in the flat as well to keep things nice and cool, especially on a day like today. Uh, there's storage, hidden storage behind uh, the TV unit there. And what a room. So this is your living, dining room. There's a little study area in the corner, which again has got uh, storage tucked away behind. Uh, and uh, as you can see, there's speakers in the ceiling, hidden in the ceiling, um, around the recessed lighting. And again, it's, uh, it's got a very, very good sound system throughout the apartment. So as we go back, back to the entrance hall, we'll go through to the kitchen, which again has underfloor heating in here. Very nice size kitchen with center island and a couple of stalls around. And it's exceptionally bright up here. So you have all the appliances you would expect. A Siemens fridge freezer, Miele oven, double oven, and a hot plate below. Again, melee appliances here, you've got uh, a induction hob and your extractor fan above. Uh, melee dishwasher, so it's all top and high spec appliances. And a uh, very nice sink built into the granite worktop. A separate utility room, housing the washing machine and tumble dryer. A further sink and additional storage. And your rubbish gets collected by the porters outside that door over there. Uh, also, actually a TV on the wall and uh, built-in rad. I must mention that the heating and hot water in this apartment is part of the communal system, so it gets paid for by the service charge. Uh, this is bedroom number two. Uh, built-in storage, which I'll show you on the way out. Uh, so bedroom number two, again, you have air conditioning, vents, sound system, TV on the wall, uh, nice size uh, double bed. Uh, some shelves area over there. Again, nice aspect. Very quiet at the rear. Uh, small built-in storage cupboard, as well as uh, these are sliding uh, mirrored doors there for additional storage. And uh, if we just go through into the bathroom, you are greeted with a fantastic sized uh, walk-in shower. Again, really beautiful in, uh, finishes inside. Uh, you have a uh, washdown basin with storage below. Uh, again, with uh, like a limestone finish, uh, mirrored medicine cabinets above, and uh, the WC there as well. So now move on to the master bedroom. Again, fully air conditioned. A really, really beautiful room. It's actually quite spacious. And it has a whole um, separate dressing area as well. Again, enjoys the same rear view. Again, double glazing. The blinds are down at the moment. But 
uh, you have, as you can see, a good amount of space, dressing table area. This here is the ensuite bathroom for the master bedroom, which is, as you can see, again, it's absolutely beautiful. So you've got a jacuzzi bath with TV over the bar. You do have a separate window, which is always a nice feature. Has a glorious sized, really spacious, again, walk-in shower unit with a even larger rain shower head there. And it's just, it's just done to an exceptionally high standard, as you can see. So separate toilet and bidet. And again, double washout basin with mirrors over and lots and lots of storage. Again, speakers in the ceiling for your, your sound system. And through to here, just to show you the large walk-in wardrobe area. Again, storage on both sides, floor to ceiling, and the same on this side as well with uh, lots of drawers. And uh, also to, to mention that the door, the heights of the doors are all raised. Again, very nice feature, as you can see there. So it really does accentuate the ceiling height of this apartment. Uh, but I'm gonna end the tour of the flat, again, showing you the view, which I think is just breathtaking and spectacular. And this is really what it's all about. This view is stunning. And it takes on a whole different atmosphere in the evenings as well, with all the, all the lights. Well, that was the apartment itself. Now let me show you what else it has to offer. The building, the common parts, and the lift, and the underground parking. So here we go. At the front of the building, you have the car park area over there, which is ideal for, for visitors and guests as well as for dropping off things like shopping, which the porters will help you here as well. Uh, so as we approach the entrance to the building, again, just panning around, you see here, that's the junction of Prince Albert Road and Avenue Road as well. So you're particularly well situated there. Literally just over there is the entrance to Regent's Park, which is a spectacular position to be in. So as we enter the building, we are greeted with actually some very, very delightful common parts. And there's the concierge over there, extremely friendly. And uh, we walk through to a uh, little lobby area over here as well, which uh, is actually one of the nicest uh, communal areas that you'll find along amongst these blocks in the area. Uh, the flat is on the seventh floor. It's actually a very good sized lift, as you can see. Uh, and the lift, it houses eight people. The passenger lift takes you to the basement level uh, and there's a door over there which leads you right in through to the car park. Uh, so you can see cars uh, access uh, the car park from those uh, gates over there, security gates. And uh, this is the car park area here as well. The spaces are actually very good sized. Uh, this apartment comes with two spaces. Uh, this one over here, which is a exceptionally large space in fact, uh, the other space as well is uh, sort of um, isolated by itself so you can fit two very very equally large sized cars in these two spaces that the apartment comes with uh, even as large as uh, two Rolls Royces for example. Uh, there's only 25 apartments in the building, a uh, very exclusive block. So that concludes the tour of this really special apartment. If you'd like to arrange a viewing please get in touch. Hope to see you soon.